all right guys so i'm back i told you guys i was gonna show you guys uh the big item that i bought let me just show you these few umd movies it's three of them that i bought um and i was gonna tell you guys i always get asked do you have every us umd movie i always hesitate to say yes because i honestly don't know i i try to buy as many as i can when i know that i don't have it uh for example this is um i'm yoji or something like that i just got this on mercari um it's one that i didn't have dark tales from japan also this one's brand new i got it from mercari um these ones i did not know i was missing but they are u.s u.s releases so when everybody asks me oh do you have uh the complete u.s u.s uh drop i don't know i i, I always find new stuff i always find stuff that i'm missing and it's almost always a common title that i'm missing just because of the fact that um there's just so much stuff that got released which is cool um like I, I was telling you guys in my last video, I'm a little bit like, uh, so I slowed down a little bit just because of the fact that I'm having trouble finding stuff, uh, getting stuff imported. Another title that I found was this one. This is a Japanese adult title. I found this on Mercari also. Um, something via the the initials on the side is VIP. I can't show the back because it's pretty aggressive. But uh, the only thing that surprised me about this UMD movie is that it's region all. Um, almost, I want to say until this one i hadn't seen any japanese und movies that were region all at um so that surprised me a little bit but i'm sure it has something to do with it being adult an adult film that they assumed that everybody was gonna watch um but yeah so let me show you guys i moved this stuff over here um this is the shelf that held my psps and there's my dogs so i moved everything over here just because of the fact that i needed the room on the other side of the room um these are my uh, UMD movies doubles. A lot of them are Japanese, so I mean, these do not play in the US, on the U.S. system. Make sure when you're buying uh, Japanese exclusive movies or uh, European exclusive movies, you have a Region Two system. And then the games. These are my games. Everybody always asks me, "Hey, how many games do you have? Do you collect the games?" In reality, I, I whenever I get to about 150 uh, to 200, I end up selling them off. I only keep what I like. So out of here, maybe I would sell about 20 of them. Um, yeah, because the rest, those 20, I'm not going to play. About 50 games on, in the PSP library are the ones that I actually like and actually play. So, yeah, that's that. And then, um, like, this is my sis my setup where I'm, I'm big on Xbox 360, so I've been playing a lot of Xbox 360. And then I have my... Final Fantasy PSP right here. I'm a big Iron Man fan, so yeah. And this is the big item I just purchased. So it is my PSP kiosk. I would I never thought I'd find one. I found it two hours south of me. I live in the Central Coast in California, so this was in the LA area. And um, yeah, it's an amazing piece. Uh, it's fully functional. Let me see. Um, so I'm gonna play. This is the PSP demo, the original demo and yeah it's awesome it's complete the only thing that's missing is this basket right here it had a little basket that holds the inserts but other than that i mean yeah um i was having trouble figuring out where to put this but i think it looks great in the center of the room with the accessories next to it and um yeah another thing i'm excited for is i had enough room to put all uh well most of my complete psp systems up there um i had to put some on my on my bed um this thing this psp speaker is awesome i haven't tried it though i heard it's really good my buddy of mine who has a few of them he always shows the sound quality and it's great um but yeah and then this is the other the rest of the umd movies um if you guys have any questions go ahead and message me or add on the comment um but yeah i mean I have uh, box sets, some more adult stuff. People always ask me too, do you do you seek out the adult stuff? I do not, just because of the fact that I don't go, go out of my way to really watch them. And then also the anime. There's so much Japanese anime that it has no English subtitles or tracks that it's not even worth watching for me. I, at least I don't think. Um, I mean, I, I enjoy anime. I mean, the Gundam stuff. Um... What else is on here? Um, let me see. 
Skate Flower, uh, the Dragon Ball Z stuff. There's one Dragon Ball Z release. Um, like I said, yeah, I, I can appreciate the anime, but if I can't read it and I can't understand it, uh, I don't see the point of getting it. So I buy it if I see it. Um, but like, if I put this on right now, I can see it, what's going on, but really, I don't know what's going on. So, yeah. But back to the kiosk, like I said, it's complete. Um, I got a little bit of slack for what I paid for it, but honestly, the last one I saw sold about a year and a half, two years ago, and it was missing the TV, which is the hardest, one of the hardest parts to, to buy. It was missing the TV um, holder, which is actual lockbox on the back. Um, and it was also missing the PSP holder. So I think I did pretty well. Um, it's something I'm going to keep. I'm not flipping. I'm not looking to make money on it. So yeah, I mean, I love it. I was never expecting it. The only other thing is, I don't know if I'm going to get a mini DVD player to go to the back of this because this is meant to have a PSP 1000, which has no video output. And maybe in the mini DVD player, um, run one of these DVDs, which has a PSP gameplay. I have a few different ones. So that's an idea, but that'll be down the line right now. I'm just enjoying this thing. I love it. It looks great in the room, the signs. Yeah. So if you guys have any questions, concerns, comments, uh, yeah, put them down there. And I, I'm pretty good about to, I'm pretty good at getting back at people. So just let me know guys. Thank you guys.